Hey, what's up everyone? Sam here. Before we get into the video, do remember about the rolling giveaway. Every video I release, I'll be giving away a pair of these awesome unisex round keyhole sunglasses. All you gotta do to win is be the first person to comment on any of my new uploads. So turn on channel notifications, follow me on Twitter, Instagram and Snapchat so you know when I'll be dropping a new video. But anyway, here are five world-changing inventions that were covered up. Number 5. Sloot Digital Coding Imagine if there was a type of code that could change the way we use computers and any other digital device. Well, there was and it was called Sloot Digital Coding. Essentially, this code could compress digital files without affecting their quality. For example, it managed to compress a full-length film into only 8 kilobytes in size. If you're unfamiliar with how small that is, let me break it down for you. There are 1024 kilobytes in 1 megabyte and 1024 megabytes in 1 gigabyte. So a 16 gigabyte iPhone, for example, would be about 16 million kilobytes. So the fact that a full length movie can be reduced to only 8 kilobytes is incredible. Just imagine how much storage you'd have if we all used this code. It was invented by a Dutch developer called Romke Jan Bernhard Sloot and investors lined up to get his invention to market. However, Sloot died under suspicious circumstances days before he was going to hand over the original source code. Now the world will never know how it was done. Number 4. The Ogle Carburetor in recent times with rising gas prices, having a car that is more efficient has been a huge buying factor. However, all the way back in the 1970s, a mechanic called Tom Ogle invented a carburetor that could achieve 113 miles per gallon. It managed to do this by pressurizing gasoline into a vapor cloud, then injecting it into the firing chambers. The reason Tom's carburetor never became commercially available is said to be due to the gas and oil companies. There were a lot of different licensing setbacks and hurdles that he just couldn't overcome and his invention and all the exact design information died with Ogle. Number 3. Rife Device Imagine if you invented a machine that could cure cancer. Do you think you'll be praised, rich and seen as a hero around the world? Well, all the way back in 1934, when cancer was still believed to be a virus, a man called Royal Rife created a cancer curing machine. The machine created a laser beam that could target specific cells and eliminate them. So in essence, what it did was kill cancer cells and therefore made patients cancer free. Now while it has been documented to work and there are 14 cases of terminally ill cancer patients who were cured by this machine, there are so many different types of cancers that results will vary between patients. But nevertheless, the fact that the machine did cure cancer all the way back in 1934 is pretty incredible considering back then they didn't even really know what cancer was. So you're probably wondering why on earth this machine was never made available to the public. And that's a good question. You see, Royal Rife refused to partner with the head of the American Medical Association. And it's been said that the AMA used their full weight to discredit Rife's machine, which ultimately suppressed the technology and it never made it to the public. Today, we use a similar treatment to kill cancer. Radiotherapy, for example, targets cancer cells and kills them off. Number 2. Free to run vehicles It's no secret that in a few decades, gas powered vehicles will dramatically decline. Electric cars look like they will be the future, but there are some other promising fuels that could take over. However, I bet you would never have guessed that water could be one of them. You see, making a car run on alternative fuels isn't the hard part. We could build a car that runs on compressed air for example, the hard part is making it a viable solution. Will the car have enough range? Will it have enough power? How easy would it be to fuel up etc? If there was an electric car that could be charged up in a matter of minutes and charging ports were as common as petrol stations, I can guarantee you most people would buy an electric car. Because why pay for gas when you can have the same experience for a lot cheaper? Making a car that runs on water is also perfectly possible. Stan Mayer made a buggy that ran on 100% water and guess what, it could do 100 miles per gallon. Filling it up is dead easy and it had plenty of power. Essentially, the technology behind this car could destroy the oil and gas industry. So why aren't we all driving water powered cars right now? Well, Stan Mayer died right before he could bring the technology to market. It's said he died without warning from a brain aneurysm. 
However, friends and family all agree that he was actually murdered by being poisoned. Number 1. Cloudbuster Imagine a machine that could control the weather. Wilhelm Reich is the scientist behind the Cloudbuster, a machine that could turn a dry hot summer's day into cloud and rain. During a drought that was impacting the blueberry harvest, Wilhelm invented the Cloudbuster. It sounds like science fiction, but according to Bangor Daily News, which covered the story, the machine really did turn a sunny's day into rain within a few hours despite the weather forecast saying there would be no chance of rain. Now, if this machine is legit, it really could shake up a lot of powerful industries. Wilhelm's technology was shut down and seized by the government. While being able to control when it rains doesn't sound that amazing, in reality, it could not only save millions of lives, but also completely eliminate food shortages around the world. Thank you for watching. Make sure you turn on channel notifications and follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and Snapchat so you have a good shot at winning those glasses. All you gotta do is be the first person to comment. It really is that easy. I will be giving away other prizes soon, so stay tuned to know what they are. Give this video a big thumbs up and share it with your friends. But until next time, guys, feed your mind.